All right. Now, during an interview with Entertainment Tonight, uh, Joe Marie Payton, the mom from the television show Family Matters, alleges that her co-star, Jalil White, a.k.a. Steve Urkel, and he hates when you call him that. Do not see Jalil White and call him Urkel. He will go the F off. He does not like it. Okay. Just want to let y'all know that. <laughs> Trust me on this. Uh, okay. So she said he tried to fight her while they were on set. Peyton said there was a scene where I said we can't do that standards and practices will not let that ha- that pass it's not going to happen he wanted to do it anyway he was so mad he started kicking and screaming and stuff Peyton said she walked away but heard White make a remark she asked her co-star Darius McCreary what White said he said something about she must want to melee I said what's a melee he said a fight I turned around uh, if you want to fight I would Darius McQuarrie grabbed me and I was going to whip his behind. What are your thoughts on this story? Oh, what do you Let think? Let me tell you something. Oh, go ahead, Q. Jaleel White didn't understand, baby. Joe Marie Payton Noble is from Carroll City Senior High School, the same <laughs> high school I graduated from. She'd have whooped his ass. She'd have turned his ass every which way except loose. Do you hear me? Carol City, born and bred. Shout out to Carol City, as a matter of fact, while we on the line. You don't want to mess with nobody from Carol City High. She'd have told his ass up. All right, I, yeah, fuck it. I, okay. Shout out to Carol City, everybody. Shout out to grown women. Uh, but excuse me, he was 12 years old when he joined that and when she recounted this particular incident. He was 12 years old. Now, uh, this is weird. Why is a grown woman getting ready to fight a 12 year old because i think the dynamics what we like learned from the tv man. one show was that the dynamics there had shifted because he was supposed to just do a one appearance and he he was so um endeared and everyone loved him so much that they rewrote the whole show to surround him and his character because he became a beloved character but so he became the the main focus of the show and they wrote him in and it became a huge hit so it was no longer about the other cast members but about him but he was 12 years old 12 year old kid he's been a star since three years old he was on the jeffersons he was on cosby show 12 years old they have tender tantrums when they don't get their way they kick it they holler and they scream why are you going to beat up a 12 year old that just doesn't make sense to me in my family we fight kids in miami we fight kids especially with a kid tell a grown person you must want to fight yeah i do (laughs) you know uh, joe also mentioned that the adults on set allowed him to run loose and just do whatever so listen i've been around some annoying kids where i'm like Ooh, if your mother would just turn around for just one second, I will pinch the hell out of you. I, I I get it. She's a grown woman. He's a kid. But there's some obnoxious 12-year-olds. And nowadays, 12-year-olds are killing people. So And, and, and listen, mm. listen, Al full of S-H-I-T, you from Horse Pasture, North Carolina. You know good and damn well. Ain't no it's child. Virginia. Horse Virginia, wherever. <laughs> horse Carriage, Virginia. You know damn it's well. Horse pasture, pasture Virginia. Virginia. Horse pasture, Virginia. As <laughs> country and backwoods as that sound, you know ain't no child running up on no adult and no adult talking about, oh, you're a child. I'm going to turn the other cheek. That adult going to tear that child ass up. No, nah, I, I don't. First of all, he didn't run up on her. But where I'm from, you 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 didn't talk back to an adult because yeah, by the alone. time you got home, your mama <laughs> your mama got you <laughs> your daddy got you so i you know i just find it very weird i think that this story is very weird a grown woman shouldn't be ready to fight a 12 year old child and star. a 12 year old should not threaten to fight a grown woman shanika fowler says exactly q we fight kids in the 305 okay <laughs> oh my god Listen, i believe it we I fight people it. in wheelchairs we fight homeless <laughs> people we fight old people Anybody could get it. Anybody oh, who's on it can get it. I, I All be- people cute. People in wheelchairs. Oh, jeez. I believe you. Kids. I, I think kids are just... They're the Do y'all parents. know how many times I've seen grown people get out of car and jump on some kids? <laughs> like, <laughs> And I'm not celebrating it. It just... It goes down in the 305. You mess with somebody child and bully somebody child, they mama and they aunts and uncles have jumped out of box Chevy and whooped kids' ass. <laughs> I have seen it happen in high school time and time again. We're talking about the set 
of a TV show. We're not talking about kids that do vandalism or chastise people or throw stuff or do like really bad stuff. He We're talking about a kid stuff. on the set of a sitcom. He well, was kicking stuff. What? He puffing and puffing his chest and told that lady she must want a melee. That <laughs> sound like somebody who want to rumble to me. You were like, it's going Plus down. Plus, when you say the word melee, I believe you have an old soul. That's an old man word. That's an old lady. That's not a kid I word. Even know I, what I, that I, like, I'm, yes, I'm, I'm inclined to agree with Claudia. Like, yeah, he had a grown man in there that spoke to a grown woman. 